Hey, how's it going today, everybody? And welcome to your daily tarot vibe for March 18th. My name is Robin and this is my channel, Aries Fire Tarot. So welcome here, guys. So I'm going to do a daily read for Wednesday, March 18th, and I hope you enjoy. Um, and I always use the Tattoo Tarot Ink and Intuition deck for Wednesdays. And I think you'll get a really cool message here. So let me know down below in the comments what you think. And just thanks for being here, guys. So I'm going to use a little daily tarot spread. And the first card is going to look at overall vibes for the day. So let me just... I feel like I need to shuffle one more time. I think this is a really cute little read. Um, it basically says what you should focus on and what you shouldn't. So the first card we've got here, guys, your overall vibes for the day. And um, I think this card is a little bit hysterical. I love the, his, his facial expression. Um, so the Knight of Swords, right? So it's like there's um, a period that, it's almost like a pregnant pause, you know, when you're waiting for something to happen, like you could get, you can expect the bubble to burst, right? And it's something that you may have either been patiently or impatiently waiting for. Um, you know, sometimes waiting for divine and perfect timing to roll through and finally give you what you're waiting for. It can be um, a real test of patience. So you can see here somebody a little bit in sulk mode and that happens to the best of us. So the overall vibe for today is just to remain patient because it's about to happen. It's about to go down. So what to focus on today? So we've got the death card, which is really cool. And this is kind of um, an extra death card, right? I mean, I don't know if he is participating in the ribbon Olympics, you know, you know that sport. Um, so you've got the skeleton here. So you can expect something to end that waiting period could end, you know, and that that just means that there's going to be a new beginning coming in. When you see the death card, it just means, okay, an uncomfortable situation or whatever, you're going to be reaching a new level in your life. So I know lots of people are really worried when they see the devil or the death card or certain cards come up in tarot card spreads, but don't worry about it, you guys. All this means is that it's time for a fresh start. And it could be that fresh start that you've been waiting for so intensely and sort of looking into the future or staring into the past and thinking, oh, maybe I'm doing something wrong here. You're not, it's just other things are happening in the background. The world needs to catch up to you sometimes and just keep on believing because it's almost there. And it could, it could very well happen today because we're seeing the end of a current situation here. So great card so far. So what to leave for another day? So you have the three of coins and this is the card of alchemy. So um, sometimes when you push too hard with your intention, it can really act as sort of a, almost like a repellent. So just really remember to let things flow. Um, like if you ever try to stop water from flowing, you'll find that it's just gonna find a different way to flow. So you really just have to allow the natural flow here. And I just saw angel numbers three, 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 and we've got the three here. So you've got a lot of threes from the angels. So you might want to check that out after the reading and just understand that, you know, the way that you feel about something, it, it's not going to make it happen any faster. If you're feeling frustrated about, I don't know, getting a promotion, getting a raise, you know, um, finding somebody to date, whatever it is, Feeling sulky about it might not help you at all. It could slow down your progress because everything is energy and it all mixes in with the law of attraction and your vibration and all of that stuff. Um, you know, and you definitely want this situation to come into you. So just try and keep your head up a little bit. And remember that, you know, you're really the alchemist. So don't doubt yourself. Like, just don't doubt anything. You're not doing anything wrong. There's just some, sometimes things have to align in the background that you can't see. So keep that in mind and keep on watching, but you know, try not to be like 
I don't know, and I got the words bird of prey, like don't just sit there waiting for something to come in, like you know what I'm saying? So you have some complex cards here, so try and like take a breath and just know that everything is happening for you the way that it should be, and your new beginning is just around the corner. So anyway, guys, take care and have a great day ahead. Bye.